Hey guys, welcome back. So today I wanted to show you guys how I do my eyebrows. Um, they're already like tweezed at the moment. That is um, my choice of how I choose to get rid of hairs. But I just wanted to show you guys how I like pencil them in, pencil them in, color them in, whatever I do. Um, but yeah, I do use te tweezers when I want to get rid of hairs. I think it's the least painful and the most effective way of getting rid of hairs. I know that they come back faster, but that's my choice. Um, so when I color my eyebrows in, I've been using the, I think it's pronounced Anastasia, um, the brow kit. I got this many years ago, but I still have like a lot left, so I'm not gonna like throw it out. Um, I've never used the stencils because I kind of trust my own opinion more, but if you want to use the stencils, the stencils, I'm pretty sure they're like very helpful and effective. I mean, even if you want to use them as like a guide for tweezing when you're shaping your eyebrows. Um, I do shape my own eyebrows and there's always, um, I always get questions about how I do it. One well, of my friends, I actually do a lot of my friends' eyebrows. Um, but there is a guide um, and I will show you, even though I'm not going to be tweezing my own, but basically just a handy dandy spoolie. You can get these at like Sephora. Um, that's what I have done. Is that stealing? I've always thought that they were just giving them out. Oh my gosh, what if I'm stealing? Um, there, just make sure you brush upward motion right here to the side, not like bang, but like eh, and then down in the corner. Because uh, that's just like the direction that your brows, um, your hairs grow. Um, so it looks most natural. And then, so the guide you want to follow when tweezing and shaping your eyebrows is the side of your nose don't like push your nose but like this is where your eyebrow should start um, and then if you line this up with the corner of your eye this is where your eyebrow should end and then your arch should be if you put this by your nose your pupil that's where your arch should be so wherever you're supposed to start tweezing um, you can find pictures of um, that like on Pinterest but it's very very easy if you do go get your eyebrows done that's fine um, I had my eyebrows threaded before waxed and I just choose to tweeze because I can do it very um, well on other people and myself and it's the least painful so that's what I do um, but when I color my eyebrows in I most of the time just use this palette um, I don't really use the gel or these colors like the eyebrow highlighters I just really use like both of these colors and mix them and then most of the time I just do like the side of my eyebrow. Um, but if it's a more fancier, um, not fancy, but if I just want my eyebrows to stay all day and if I'm not going to have like a spoolie around with me, I use, I don't know what it's called because it's like all faded, but it's just um, like a gel, but it's tinted, so it's brown. And I really, really like it. Um, just be careful when you're putting it on because it comes on very dark when you when you slide it on your eyebrows, so just beware. Um, but yeah, I'll just take my brush first. I always brush my eyebrows first, and what I do is I just kind of mix both colors and tap it down, tap it on my hand just to make sure that it's the right color. Oh no, my baby hairs, postpartum hairs are crazy. Just follow the natural shape of your eyebrow. It will make it look the most natural. Same with um, coloring them in. And what looks best um, when you're coloring your eyebrows in, you want the lightest color to be um, in the front and then just gradually get darker. You don't want like blocks. Um, I think it just looks best when it's natural. So I always start back here. Normally, if I'm just going to be like around the house or just going somewhere for a little bit, I'll just do the ends of my eyebrows because those I, that's the part where I feel like needs the most to work. Um, so that's what I would do if I was just going out for like a couple hours. But if I wasn't, uh, again, I would just keep tapping and make sure that it's light and then just follow the line. And normally what I do is I don't, I don't like go around my whole eyebrow. I just kind of bring it up like this. And so if you, if you put a line of the powder on the bottom of your eye, then you can just rub it in like this. That's what I do. And I think it just blends it nicest. 
you do it that way. So that's the eyebrow. Um, you can't really tell there's not like a big difference, but I think the eyebrows are like the most beautiful part of your face. And I think they're like the focal point. It can make your face. Yeah, I'm just gonna do the next, same thing on my other eyebrow. Not too harsh um, of a line. Okay, that's pretty much it. This is what my eyebrows look like when I'm finished. Um, sometimes if I'm feeling crazy, I'll take that little highlighter and then you just put it on your brow bone. Makes them pop a little more. But again, like I never do this. I'm just showing you guys just because it's a brow video and I don't have any makeup brushes, so I'm just using my binky. Whatever. Um, and if I just want a little extra um, color or just some like gel to make them stay, I just use this and again, very lightly because I have ruined my eyebrows so many times um when i was like when i first bought this because i didn't know and this is just awesome so my eyebrow will look like that all day because it just stays in the same place i think a gel can really help me you can get a clear gel if that works for you um but yeah because i've had so many so many people ask me how i do my eyebrows um i just thought i would share with you guys and i have a huge obsession with eyebrows um that's like the first thing i look at when i meet somebody <laughs> Um, sometimes I'll actually a lot of times I'll watch like YouTube videos on like eyebrow transformations I don't know if that's weird but like some people with some like really whack brows that need a lot of work some people grow them out to make these videos oh, I love them they're so much fun to watch and I find so much satisfaction in them trimming their eyebrows um but yeah that is what i do i really hope you guys enjoyed this video um i love eyebrows i love doing my eyebrows so it was pretty fun to make um if you like this video don't forget to give it a thumbs up and subscribe to my youtube channel make sure you share it with all your friends because i'm having so much fun making all these videos um but yeah that's basically it and i hope you guys love my brows and like this video